Yeah. What's the answer to number 16? D. Thanks. John, really? Are you trying to cheat in my class right now? <laughs> Students, be reminded that cheating in class in any form, whether you're giving answers or receiving answers, it is a violation of the honor code. Here's my homework, Mr. Richardson. Thank you. Wait a second. This looks a lot like Genesis's handwriting. Are you sure this is yours? Michaela, did you realize that copying somebody else's work and claiming it as your own is a clear violation of the honor code? Oh my gosh, I am so stressed. This essay is due in an hour. You know what? I'm just going to copy and paste this. Plagiarizing is a violation of the honor code. Oh my god, John, I got an email from Harvard. Cool. Let's see. I got rejected. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this is happening. Trian, I got an email from Virginia Tech. Let's see. I got rejected. I only plagiarized once! Violating the honor code can affect your ability to get into college. Violations of the honor code can get you rejected or removed from honor society. Didn't see you there. I'm here with the What the Fact crew. This week, our topic is water pollution. Water pollution is the contamination of water bodies such as lakes, rivers, and oceans. Water pollution occurs when pollutants are discharged into the bodies of water. Like this right here. The most common pollutants are hazardous chemicals, oil, fertilizer, and industrial sewage waste. Industrial development is filling the waters with toxic pollutants, which is a major threat to human health. Like this oil can right here. <laughs> water is crucial to our survival, so it's really important that we do everything we can to keep our waters clean. Some things you can do to keep our water systems clean is to not litter near anywhere that may lead to a waterway, such as this. This pipeline right here, if it were to burst, it would contaminate this entire stream. And this stream leads to major rivers as well. Thanks, Thanks for watching this week's episode of What the Fact. Gosh, this is so frustrating. These students just don't want to learn. They're never going to try, no matter what I can do. It, it, they're never going to change. So frustrated. That's not a growth mindset. That looks interesting. Can I try? Sure you can. Thanks.
This is too hard. I don't want to try anymore. It's not my fault I can't do it. I just don't have any muscles. That's not a growth mindset. 